Hello, welcome to our video. Today we're having a look at this phone. It's a, a 5 inch dual SIM Android phone um, stroke tablet. Um, so first of all, let me show you how the, the SIM card goes in. So I just need to get in there and take the back cover off. There we are. Okay, so first of all, I'll show you where the uh, the micro uh, SD card goes in for your memory. So it just goes on underneath here, and then this is a dual SIM phone. Um, the two SIMs just go uh, on top of each other. So uh, let me show you the SIMs. They just go on top of each other, just like that. This is a dual SIM phone. Um, you don't have to use two SIMs, but the fle it, it's flexible, so you can use two SIMs if you want to. So, just put the, uh, the cover back on, turn it on. While that's turning on, let me show you what you get with the phone. Um, as well as uh, one battery, we give you two. This is a very large phone, um, and with all smartphones the battery doesn't last as long so we give you an extra one so therefore you can um, have more fun with it and it will last longer you get your uh, USB data transfer charger cable there um, we also give you a UK USB charger this is a quality USB charger not like uh, a little one that you get with uh, cheaper phones like this uh, these are fine but you know th th this draws a lot of power you'll find if you use one of these it will pop this is a quality charger um, providing 1000 mAh so it's uh, excellent we give you a set of headphones to listen to music um, as well as um, take phone calls with it um, it's got a little microphone here so you can take phone calls with it too. Full English manual. Um, it's not the best manual in the world, but um, you know it's it's there, and um, you know if you need to reference it, you can do. But you know it uses Android 2.3. There's plenty of help and guides uh, online if you uh, you know do do get stuck. Of course, you can give us a call, and we'll uh, try and help you out as well. For a limited time only, we're going to give you uh, away one of these. This is like a little leather case. Uh, being the size it is, it's probably nice uh, to have a little leather case like this um, to put it in. So that just simply goes in there. It's got all the holes in all the proper places as well. So there we are. Um, so it's uh, it's very professional, very business-like indeed. So that goes in there, that closes, you've got your camera holes and your speaker holes. It's, uh, it's all very nice and elegant indeed. Okay, now that the, uh, the phone has started up, uh, let's have a little play. Uh, first of all, let's have a quick overview of uh, the, the phone. Obviously this is a 5 inch screen. On the front we have a front facing camera, we've got our Android buttons, the, the home, the menu, the back and the search, we've got the microphone here. On the bottom we've got our uh, charging port here, uh, we've got the 3.5 inch millimeter headphone jack, um, so that's uh, there and you can use any pair of headsets really so that's good um, you've got your sound rocker the volume up and down on that side on the top we've got our uh, uh, on and uh, lock button and uh, on the back we've got our back facing camera a dual flash and the speaker and uh, that's the the quick overview of the outside now let's uh, unlock it and have a little play with it there's our Android lock screen, there's our home screen. Now, those unfam unfamiliar with Android, um, this is the home screen. Now, it's similar to your, um, your, your desktop, so what you can do is you can have uh, icons, you can have widgets like here, I've got a weather widget, you can have icons for uh, shortcuts to your programs and things. Um, fully customizable, you get five of these screens, 
um, sorry, I think you get six or seven on this one, seven of these screens uh, which you can add things to. So I'm just scrolling across. I've only customized one of the screens, but you can quite easily add new icons and things. But just holding there, um, I want to add a new widget. Um, I want to add a Facebook widget. So there we are. So that will show my Facebook stream there. If I wanted to add a new thing on here, just go to widget again. I want to add a power control. And again, that's a power control. I can turn off the Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, etc. Uh, from there, there's plenty of things that you can add to these uh, screens. So it's very flexible. Right. Let's go into our uh, app tray. On here, if I click here, it shows you all things that are installed. Lots of stuff comes pre-installed, but I've installed some things already on here. This is such a, a great big screen. It's a, it's a, it's very lovely to use. Um, so you can use it for plenty of things. This talking about this screen. This is a capacitive screen, so it's a uh, very sensitive capacitive screen. So I can literally just use my finger like that and brush it across. It's not a resistive screen you find on cheaper touch screens. Uh, this has got also five point touch. Now let me demonstrate the five point touch. Normal capacitive screens have two touches. This will do five. So as you can see there, it will track five points. Now what does five points do? Uh, well, it makes the whole touchscreen experience far better, superior, and um, you know it makes it easier. The, the, the phone tracks uh, your fingers better, games are a lot easier to play. Um, overall, it, it's just a better experience to have more touch uh, points. Okay, so that's that demonstrated there. So let me show you how the multi-touch would be beneficial. So if I got go to some images on here, um, I can pinch to zoom, zoom in and zoom out. So that's really handy on web pages and pictures to zoom in and zoom in out of pictures and web pages. Also got an orientation sensor, so if I switch it over, it will switch over as well. Now, you can see how great this uh, this tablet is. Look at the screen, it's so bright and so vibrant, so responsive. The touch screen is so responsive as well. Um, it's not frustrating to use at all. I can just zoom in and zoom out. The processor works really well as well. It can process these quite large images while I'm zooming in and zooming out of them. So it's, you can see it's very, very smooth indeed. Okay, so um, that's the, the, the touch screen. Let me quickly show you uh, some applications on here as well. Uh, being such a large screen, you'll probably want to do some work and things like that. You've got documents to go on here. On here I can uh, do... Uh, I can do things like you can do on your PC, I can do Word documents, I can do Excel documents uh, on here, I can do PowerPoint documents as well. Um, so you know that that's uh, an excellent thing to have while you're out and about because this sort of size screen it's in between a phone and a tablet. If you find a tablet too big and a phone too small this is what you'd want. Okay, so I've got another Office soft here, uh, software in here called Kingsoft. Um, let me show you quickly how. There we are. So that's Kingsoft. I can zoom in on here and I can type and edit this document just like that. So I can type, edit it. While I'm out and about, I can even flip it across this way. There we are. You get okay. The, idea. the other thing that you might want to do with this tablet phone is possibly play games on it. Games will be uh, very nice on this uh, very uh, nice screen. So um, let's uh, show you a few games.
Okay, so there you have it on the game front. I mean, there's uh, there's plenty more things that it's capable of uh, in terms of games-wise, but uh, you can see that the the game. 3D chip on it is quite spectacular. It can handle uh, 3D games very, very well. Um, so you'll be assured that any games you uh, download are going to pretty much work with this uh, this tablet phone. All right. Let me show you another thing quickly. I want to pull this down here. This brings my notification down. You can see I've got two SIMs in here: my T-Mobile and my Vodafone just so you know they're both active at the same time so essentially it's like carrying two phones with you now on the top here I've got a quick uh, sort of settings button that I can turn my Bluetooth my GPS my data and things uh, on and off um, I've also got the sound profiles on the other side as well so that's a really good feature I'm just going to turn my Wi-Fi on because what I'm going to show you now is the uh, the Google Play Store it's called now I think um, where I can download new applications, I can download books, I can download movies, I can download games, um, most of which are free. Um, so that's excellent. So if I go on here, I can have a look at um, top paid games, top free games. There's absolutely hundreds and thousands of, of games and applications. So that's really, really great as well. If I go to the browser here, um, I can just show you um, the internet, loads up pretty fast, pretty quick. Of course I'm using Wi-Fi, but you can use your SIM card if you've got data on there as well. Really simple to use as well, the keyboard comes up, I just type in what I want to find. In this case it's us. Search. So you can see the internet works pretty well on it. We can also zoom in and out with the pinch uh, to zoom, like I mentioned earlier. So, yeah, there's your browser. It works very nicely indeed. The other thing that I would use uh, a, a nice big screen like this for is probably reading books. Now, I've downloaded the uh, the Google Books, books application um, so I can uh, download books for free or paid books if I want to. Um, so let me just find where it is. There we are. Now I can go to the uh, the Google uh, App Store and download new books for free. Um, there's also paid books as well. Um, and the books work really well on here. Um, they're re on, on this nice screen it's uh, really really nice to to read it on here and it's very smooth and it's very very clear indeed as well so uh, yeah they there you have the uh, the Google uh, play books Okay, so let's wrap this up then. Um, this phone stroke tablet is for those people who want uh, something smaller than a tablet, but something bigger than a phone. Um, this fits that sort of need absolutely perfectly. Um, so you could use it just as a tablet, um, or you could use it as a phone and a tablet. Taking two SIMs as well, that's uh, beneficial. Some people, they have a great uh, SIM for their phone calls and texts, and they don't necessarily get a great deal on their data. So this enables you to have flexibility. You could get another SIM uh, for data. Um, so uh, you could use one SIM exclusively for calls and one SIM for data. Um, or you can use both for, uh, uh, for calls as well. There's nothing stopping you doing that. Having the two SIM slots gives you that flexibility. Essentially, it's carrying two phones at the same time. This big screen is is superb. So if you do want a big screen, this is great as well. Very nice and easy to use with a capacitive touchscreen. It's uh, very responsive and very quick. Has a great processor um, as well, so it handles things very well. Coupled with the the 3D chip, which is separate from the processor, it does handle thing uh, the games and um, any applications that are quite demanding very well. Of course, this comes in built with GPS as well, so if you wanted to use it as a GPS device, uh, you could do. 
so um, yeah there's the phone uh, stroke tablet if you do want to get one do buy one quick because uh, I anticipate these will sell out quite quick thanks very much for watching our video